to of Louis platform. So I'll show how to log into Louis.ai. So in the first part, I have explained uh, the architecture. So Louis is basically language understanding and integration platform, and uh, it acts as a natural language processing engine. So which is uh, pre-built functionality. So we don't have to write our own source code uh, and uh, use Python modules here uh, because it is already made for us. So here you can create your application that should be the first step. So basically there are two things here creating entity, creating intent and entity and then utterances. So this is intent and entities are words like I want to book taxi from uh, let's say Delhi to Mumbai so maybe Delhi and then Mumbai so Delhi and Mumbai will be entity and intent will be book taxi and utterances are the whole world which uh, user will say something like I want to book taxi from Mumbai to Delhi so this thing this whole thing is utterance okay so let's create a new application book bike okay so here are some examples that you can see book a flight to Seattle, book buy three tickets to New York so you can see there are two apps so these are nothing but intents so if user says something like I want to book bike so it should come here if user will say I want to book taxi so it should be identified as book taxi but I then you have to add some utterances also create new intent something like book book bike okay then you have to you add utterances I want to book bike then other person can say I want to book two wheeler other pen person can say I want to book scooty scooter okay so these things user can user can say so now we have to train it so that it will be published to the NLP engine and then publish it Mint analysis on and publish it In book taxi so again you have to add so book car okay so it's already there book a I want a cab call a cab book a cab I want to book four wheeler
I want to look a car. I want to look cab. Okay, later we'll see how to add phrases, patterns, all those things, but let's now complete the basic part. go to manage and then resources so key and then this is the id okay so tier is free so it has this string example query so copy this and then paste here so your query should be here i want to book a bike so I'm just showing you in the URL so score is 0 0.97 0 0.97 so it's almost like book uh, matching tool so this is the intent okay and yeah here also you can test something like book a bike and see what is your intent so we are in book bike okay book a taxi Okay, it's going in uh, book by but score is less, so highest score will be matched. Okay, book a taxi, then book two wheeler, so it should be closer to 0 0.9 or something. Okay, so book it is going in book bikes, so it's good. This is somewhere I feel this should go to book cab actually, right? So we'll go to book cab. The taxi is test. Okay, so book car zero point nine. So this is your URL so this is the intent so the same thing you will be doing uh, using the SDK or programmatically using the Lewis framework for Python and C sharp so the same thing you have to just um, uh, in the chatbot emulator you will enter some string and then uh, if you say something like I want to book a bike so then uh, there will be API's which will connect to the Lewis using the app key and ID so this is the string which will be formed finally and then uh, the query will be made and then it will be mapped so when it is mapped to book bike then you have you can process uh, after that you can process accordingly that okay book bike then you you will ask like from where to where okay again if something like book cab is there then you will ask different questions book taxi so you can see again come to Azure resources copy this so here let's say book a bike this book car it is coming in book car 994 so intent returned is book car so you have to add more number of utterances to get the perfect result
book four wheeler is the query and the intent is book car okay so it is correct so basically you have to use uh, this uh, id's app id and uh, the key in your uh, program if you are using if you are trying to build this book taxis if you are uh, trying to book book bike then you have to use the this book bike uh, azure resources so this is the key for this for your book taxi the azure resources is different azure resource is different 529 something let's uh, copy this key key is different and here query is also the id so this is the id part this is the id part after apps b0b okay so book taxi book bike azure resources so you can see 56a key is almost same okay b6a ending okay key is same but id is different there it was something like starting from b so let's copy this to verify okay so db1 for this book book bike and let's see for book taxi okay starting from b0b and here it's different so app id is different and key is same so for both the apps if you want to build if you are building for book bike you have to use bike uh, app id and key if you are building for taxi you have to use taxi okay okay if i'll say book flight Okay, book flight so it's coming to book car so that's why you have to add more number of intent to uh, match it properly because it's coming to book car so more number of utterances you have to add okay thanks friend thanks for watching next video i'll uh, also use python program and i'll show how to detect it using the python api like and uh, subscribe and also put your comment to what uh, if any information i have missed or i have to add i will add this those information thanks for watching